just a quick overview of the buttons on the GXP2160. On the left of the screen, you've got your six lines. This enables you, in essence, to, to operate six lines at the same time. If you receive a call or make a call, it will automatically use the first line and you can open up six additional or five additional lines for a total of six subsequently. These soft buttons here will link up to the menu options right above them on the screen. These will change depending on what you do on the phone. You've got your number keys here to dial numbers, your arrow keys to navigate the menu system. If you, for instance, press that button, you'll go into your menu. You can now go left and right into the different options and you can now press this button to go back home. You've got your volume. Uh, if no call is in progress, this will control the volume of your ringtone. If you're in a call, it will control the volume of the handset. You've got your green um, button here for making a call. So if you are going to be using the on hook dialing, for instance, you can put your number in and press the green button to dial. The red button is your speaker phone. So you can press this button during a call and you will activate the speaker. On this panel here, first button there is your voicemail button to access your voicemail. That is your phone book button, your transfer button. This is for blind and attended transfers. This is your conferencing button, which works similar to a transfer, except that it will connect all the parties. The pause button will put the call on hold. When you press this button during a call, the other party will receive music on hold. If you have a headset on your phone, you'll press this button to activate the headset. The last one here is your mute button. During a call, if you press this button, your microphone will be muted on your handset. If you press this button in a state like it is now, not in a call, it will actually activate the do not disturb function. This means that if someone tries to phone you now, it will say that you are not available. On the right hand side here, you've got your soft buttons, which will typically be programmed to extensions that you oftentimes phone. The lights will be green if the extensions are available, red if someone is busy on the specific extensions, and black if that extension is not currently registering.